good roads, pipe bomb water, education, amongst several social amenities, are key for the development of a people. But when these things are lacking, it becomes a huge problem. For the Kurudu area of Lagos, which is perhaps the fastest growing axis in the city, a community which has grown is lacking some basic facilities. In this special report, our correspondent Shio Okimbale visited the Ori Okuta community of Ikorodu where the people are asking government to come to their aid. Ori Okuta, a densely populated residential area of Ikorodu in Lagos State. As soon as you approach the junction that leads into Oriokuta from the mainstream Ikorodu roads, what hits you is a feeling that you may be in for one of the bumpiest rides of your life. The roads in Oriokuta are more of ditches and potholes. A drive through the roads is pure nightmare. Public transporters have deserted Oriokuta because of the state of the roads. Those who have their own cars face a daily risk of burden of putting their cars through the terrible Oriokuta roads. For those without cars, their own means of getting through these roads are via the banished motorcycles, popularly called the Orkadas. Oriokuta is a community which lacks virtually all forms of infrastructure. No public schools, no good roads, no pipe on water. And when people take ill here, the option of a proper health care is next to nothing. This is Oriokuta Health Center in Ikorodu West LCDA of Lagos. Well, this is the only option most people who live in Oriokuta have when it comes to medical and health services. Inside this health clinic, the rooms, the walls, the toilet, all of them are torn apart. In fact, there are no windows in some of the places where health services are discharged. And when patients come into this place, this is perhaps the only place where they have to wait for their turn. Before, there were deliveries, but now that's not possible. Ikorodu's population is estimated at about 800,000 from the last census in 2006. Oriokuta is just one community in Ikorodu. The community association heads here say there are about 2.5 million people living here. That figure may be out of place considering the last census, but in the records of contributions and list of houses in this area, the fear is Oriokuta may be housing a population far beyond the predictable. Contributions to fixed infrastructure in Oriokuta is a usual activity. Some of the community leaders keep records of these contributions, even with their meager income. The people of Oriokuta contribute as much as 10,000 naira each time, while some others do 5 or 3,000 naira. This is Lagos State Government Road, and nothing has been done. Nothing, absolutely nothing. When you say way. nothing, yes. I can see the drainages on both sides. Yeah. When did those on one come? These drainages on both sides, both sides were done by people within this community. As they are coming, they are doing it. Look, are you call these drainages? Can we call these drainages? Mm. This is not up to the standard of Lagos State Government. During rainy season, people leave their homes and go to the town to escape the problem of Oriokuta. At the local council office, the chairman was not on seat when Channels Television visited. But the councillor representing the area tells us the plans for Oriokuta community. You know, the level of things in the local government, you know, most of the projects in local government in Oriokuta is not what the local government is capable of or can be put in place for now. The federal lawmaker representing Ikorodu in the House of Representatives, Abike Dabri Arewa, has one time or the other lent a hand of support that hardly is sufficient considering the enormity of their challenges. It's um, no excuses, but a lot of work is being done. I also want to again commend the people of Oriokuta for their maturity and approach and attitude to this their demands. And they're not even sitting there waiting for government. They're also going ahead and doing things for themselves. So please, um, Oriokuta is not neglected. The people of Oriokuta are asking government to intervene in their case as the population of the area grows. The burden of infrastructure too is on the increase. And they're saying that the government needs to come to their aid 
and fast. From Oriokuta, area of Ikorodu Local Council Development, area of Lagos State, Sheung Okimbaloye, reporting for Channels Television News.